Oh, it's a good sign when we need to set up more chairs. So we like that. Um, thank you so much for coming tonight. Uh, my name is Leslie Kimball, and I'm the library director here in town. I believe that this is our 16th year um, hosting a voter night. We used to call it Candidates Night, but we've moved to calling it Voter Information Night um, because uh, we're covering a lot more than candidates. Uh, we like to make sure we get through the warrant articles and uh, so that everybody has the information they need to make good decisions coming up um, on election day and town meeting. So I certainly want to thank all of you who've come out tonight. Um, you are, of course, the most important reason that we're here, um, is our voters who are coming to make good decisions about uh, what's happening in town over the next year and beyond. Um, I am going to take a minute for the library before we jump into the rest of the town um, because we have some very exciting news. I don't know if everyone has seen it online. Um, but uh, there's an organization uh, at the federal level called the Institute for Museum and Library Services. And they are that arm of the federal government that um, supports and advocates for museums and libraries. Uh, and uh, they have a process where they, every year they give out what they call uh, national medals for museum and library services. And it's for institutions who have uh, provided exceptional uh, service to their communities. And on Monday, it was announced that the Wigan Memorial Library is a finalist yeah. for it. Yeah. Thank you, it's very exciting. Um, I believe that uh, this particular event certainly has played into uh, one of the reasons why we were chosen as a finalist. It's very exciting. Um, so there is some information at the back about the medal um, and about ways that you can support us online. At this point, um, as finalists, there's nothing else we can do. Uh, we need to uh, go on our laurels that we already have. The committee is working on um, choosing the folks who will win the medal. They usually give out 10 medals in a year. There's 14 library finalists and 15 museum finalists. And um, we are the only uh, library finalist in New England, the only finalist, in fact, in New England. So we're very proud of that. And we hope that the community is really proud um, of our library as well. We know that we wouldn't be a finalist without all the support that we've gotten over the years and the great partnership that we have. So there isn't anything more we can do, but we're inviting the community to really celebrate with us and get out there on social media and online, tell your friends and neighbors about this really exciting uh, thing that's happening, and please share your stories of why the library is important to you and the great experiences that you've had with the library over the years. And you'll see there's some hashtags that they're using and things like that. So we definitely want to spread the word to anyone in the community who hasn't had the opportunity to find out everything the library offers, um, but also just take the chance to celebrate all the great things that our library and our community are doing together. So would love it if you'd participate in that. 